New developments in the murder case against the man accused of killing a well-known tech executive in San Francisco. Prosecutors began laying out their case against Nemo Momeni at his preliminary hearing. He's accused of stabbing Cash App founder Bob Lee in a late night argument that prosecutors say was over Momeni's sister. Lee's death sent shockwaves through the tech community and revealed a lifestyle of heavy drug use and partying. Our Lauren Toms was in court today where prosecutors started showing their evidence today, right? Yeah, Liz, Nima Momeni confidently entered a San Francisco courtroom this morning as his new defense team went to work trying to poke holes in the prosecution's evidence. In court, prosecutors showing the three and a half inch paring knife just like this. They say was used to fatally stab Cash App founder Bob Lee on the morning of April 4th. It matches the brand found in Momeni's sister's apartment. That's where Lee Momeni and his sister were together hours before the stabbing. Security camera video capturing a wounded Bob Lee collapsing in the East Cut neighborhood after being seen with Momeni in a white BMW. The knife found in a nearby Caltrans parking lot. But the defense says too many questions remain surrounding how evidence was gathered and processed by the SFPD. Usually, and in my experience, when you want to see if someone's touching something, you do fingerprint analysis, right? Because as we know, because of COVID, DNA can be expelled in coughing, sneezing, talking in close proximity. I mean, there's a lot of ways DNA can get from one place to the next, okay? Fingerprints are a different story. And they weren't done on the handle, which is the most important relevant portion of who, if any, was handling that item. No recording devices were allowed in court as Judge Harry Dorfman presides over the preliminary hearing that aims to determine whether the case should go to trial. And after weeks of postponement, we got the first glimpse of how Momeni's new team from Florida will build their defense. I wonder why we don't have complete testing, logical steps that would be taken to provide a complete picture. We do wonder why we don't have that. Throughout Monday's hearing, Momeni's two top lawyers, Sam Zangane and Bradford Cohen, poked holes in how four witnesses of the SFPD gathered and processed evidence, including why fingerprints were not taken of the suspected murder weapon. Prior to me coming on, indicated that they believed that uh, my client had uh, malice against Bob Lee for drugging and sexually assaulting or whatever it was, however you guys put it, his sister. And that's not the case. That's not the evidence. That's not the evidence that the government provided us through their, through their testimony and their interviews, right? So Prosecutors have said the evidence points directly to Momeni, who they say was upset over Bob Lee's suspected relation with his sister. Text messages later recovered show Kazar Momeni was concerned that her brother might have overreacted to events earlier that evening. The preliminary hearing will continue tomorrow morning, where we expect to hear from witnesses for the defense. Liz?